you're feeling right now is irrelevant. I'm talking any anxiety, doubt, any irrational thinking, anything that's like not to do with your purpose or what you plan on doing is irrelevant, like irrelevant, irrelevant, because those emotions is not you. They do not make you who you are. Actually, emotions is kind of everybody. If you understand energy, that's how emotions are. So you could have just picked up someone's emotions. Somebody could be projecting certain energy thoughts towards you. This caused certain emotions to arise. So that's why I said, listen to your spirit. Do not focus on like how you feel. And if you can be aware of this, alter those emotions based off your awareness. If you're aware of your emotions, you can actually alter them at will. This is when you have more power over yourself. This is what I'm saying, yo. This is how you evolve and you actually change your molecular. Because when you when you can control your emotional state, your thoughts, aka this vehicle, you actually become the authority of your own world. <laughs> you actually become the one like Neo. Just picture that. Yeah, because then you take back your power and your awareness is belief. Therefore, you claim that power. That's what I'm saying. Your mind can do some amazing things when it has awareness. That's why a lot has went into it. So if you have any like conflicting thoughts, just know it's trying to oppose you from like something greater. So what do we do? We do opposite. So based off how you feel, if you're feeling really low, that is when you're supposed to feel really high and just be thankful because a lot is going in your favor. A lot more to benefit you in the next coming chapter than you could even realize. That's why I was saying like if it's the left, go right. If it's the right, go left. And I only say that because it's. Nine times out of 10, everything is switched. Meaning, if you focus on external, right? They say it's this one, right? But it's really that one. Because why would somebody tell you something that's going to better you and give you control over yourself in the system? Make you a key one player. They won't, right? So you want to do opposite because chances are that's the correct way. Just like you. Just like this place, actually, because it's not compiled of just light. It's compiled of dark and light. Because for there to be light, it has to become dark, Darkness is light. You're about to see real quick, not in no fearful kind of way, but I'm saying the original sun is actually dark. It's not what you or what appears to be outside. That's actually a replica. So I'm saying is everything has proven to be opposite when you go in and you like rely on spirit, intuition. So right now, how you're feeling? Don't focus on that. It does not matter. And I bet you're feeling conflicting thoughts because it's trying to deter you. It's doing a number of things, but just know no matter what is trying to conflict you or deter you or not, just always remember that chances are this is an opportunity to level up from it or this is an opportunity to descend. You can either choose which route to take. You feel me? So that being said, always take the opposite route because chances are that's going to be the one that benefits you. And you know what I mean? Your parents told you to go to college and you're looking like, oh, man, they're stressful and they're broke. Then you realize you should have just started that social media marketing company and then just went and did that with your friends and had fun. Dude, I mean, or lady, you would have been living like a rock star. I'm saying you consistently doing that. Plus, you having fun doing what you're doing. That that is called creating. You're being yourself. So therefore, you're going to have a lot more to give. Therefore, it's going to bring a lot more currency financial gain. That is why social media brings so much because you're 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 affecting not just yourself, you're affecting others. So therefore, you are providing a feel, you are filling a spot, you are providing a need, a service that actually a lot of people need that they don't even realize. Because what are they doing right now? At home, bored, either in their heads, or they could be communicating and then learning something. You see what I'm saying? Which one would you want to do? Would you want to waste your time? Staying complacent, stagnant, or would you want to go out there and see other perspective, other alterios, you feel me? Other insights, not just like thinking from like this closed minded, you feel me? Because that, what is that? Same consistency that brings stagnation or whatever comfortable or uh, comfortable zone you were, you know, complacent in, or you can get out of that comfort zone because that is the only way you will live. That's going to bring you the utmost fulfillment. Get out of your comfort zone. You can't, especially being a man, you can't build a life for yourself nor family one day being in a comfortable zone. It does not work. It just does not pan. So you have to start much quicker versus later. You build momentum much faster. I'm telling you, so you'll see really quick if you haven't already. I guarantee after you watch this video, you'll start to see scenarios real time, real life in this present moment. That's going to show you 
you know, truth or not. It's going to show you that, you know, validation It's going to give you that confirmation that you're looking for. And you'll start to see everything is meant for your greatest season. But you just got to do the opposite. Don't take the don't take the rat bait. Don't take the trap. Don't fall for the okie. Don't 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 go for the quick quick. You know what I'm saying? Don't don't go for the slip and slide. You feel me? Don't get hood hoodwink. Don't get ballywample. Don't get wally. Don't get uh got got. Don't get you feel me? Because they're so there's intent. And there's another thing I want to tell y'all. Stop touching people. When you touch people, they actually can start doing things on you, affecting your aura field. Now, actually, a lot of work that you wouldn't necessarily had to do. Yes, it makes you stronger, but don't touch people. That is not good, especially. Or don't touch people that you know is not had done the work. Those people who you are aware of that has not done the work, try not to exchange physical contact because you can, you will, or chances are you have picked up something that you either had to get rid of or need to get rid of in this present moment, because that's things that your eyes don't necessarily see all the time that can affect you if you gather or if you make yourself that accessible to things that you are not well equipped for. All right. And I'm going to just leave it at that. So stop doing that. Do the 180. Chances are, if a person wants to shake your hands, do all love, I said, I'm gonna let you know, and, and you know, keep it pushing. Or if a person want to hug, I wouldn't recommend it. But if they want, but if they don't want to hug, hug them. You feel me? Do the opposite. Switch it up. If they don't want to shake hands, shake their hands. Yeah, now we talking. If they, if they want to get close, move away. If they try to move away, get close. You feel what I'm saying? Be all up in there. Be like, yeah. So you ain't brush your teeth yet? You be like, how you doing? How you doing over, Miss? You know, and if it's a dude, be like, "What up, my man?" You know, and I'm just best with you. If it's a dude, I guess you know, say so still keep your way. But if a lady, don't get too close because you know nowadays it's actually. Let's just say they could start throwing charges at you. We gonna leave it at that. So, but my my point is, start getting the habit of doing the opposite. I guarantee you're gonna see different looks, different everything. It's gonna be crazy funny. You feel me? All right. So that's what I'm saying. I mean, and it's best for right now anyway, because as you come into yours, well, let's just say you can't really trust too many people, which is just the plain truth. I hope you realize that now. But there are still cool people out there that have like. Minded uh, ideology, so they only want to put out good. They understand energy, which is why you're watching this video. Other than the narcissists and the Decepticons and the people that's trying to pull information to use against. Other than that, no, you're watching this video because you still have you know high vibrational tendencies. You're chosen, and you still retain the Holy Spirit. No different than a two year old. I mean, less than two 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 year old been demonically possessed. Other than that, I'm sure it still contains the Holy Spirit as well, which is holy divinity. For those of you wondering, these are. Um, aroma Guru Room Sprays. They're like cool mist, lavender, spearmint, uh, peppermint. Really good to just declutter, release uh, old, stagnated, flush out old, um, clear the space, a lot of stuff like that. So, for those who are wondering. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching the video. If you made it to this end, you just like straight up look the goat, yo. And I just want to wish all the greatest things in your life. Watch this whole new chapter is going to be for your benefit. And you're going to see, you're going to come back to the video. You're going to remember, you'll be like, man, KT told me. And I'm going to be like, yo, it's all good, yo. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of such, I have a way that you can show your gratitude and your thanks. Just check in the description box. I have two different options where you can show your love anytime. All right, guys. So thank you for watching Etos. Everything on the other side, the other side of the spectrum. Inside of the veil.